Hey, I'm Chris Berman. Coming up on ESPN, we'll see a guy that in only seven seasons has already crept into the NFL's top 30 in all-time rushing yards. The bruising Corey Dillon. Oops. Hello there, I'm Dan Stevens, and welcome to Gillette Stadium. My partner in crime. One that went right down to the last play. It's Tom Brady going up type of matchup that true football fans wait all year for. That Hasselback is a superb quarterback. This guy is totally focused. When he's on the field, he is in the game. You won't see him making very many mistakes. Warming up across the field is another tremendous football player. Tom Brady is definitely one of the very top players. fun to watch him to see how athletic wide open the NFL has become so fans they love it this way so you're gonna love this game Steven Gostowski in position to start today's game Baldwin's and with that kick we're underway Baldwin's got a chance for a return. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. Wilson's heading on to the field. He'll be leading. Alexander gains five on the play, and that will bring up second down. Chris Gray used all his strength to excavate a hole in the D and create some room for the runner. I tell you what, when the O-line is clicking like that, every 27. Lynch looking for a lane. Ends up picking up three yards. He caught the winning touchdown in overtime and the NFC title game in January of 2015. Jermaine Curse. Well, he showed everybody that he has toughness. He can run routes. He's got good size. That's everything you want in a wide receiver. Second down and seven. And they're all over him for the sack. The Patriots defense. Balls incomplete, but it would have been a minimal gain had they completed it anyway. The Seahawks on their offensive play sheet, they don't have many plays for third and long situations, but that is a really nice job that time by the offense, the quarterback. They pick up the first down. That'll get you going. Is one confident QB. Third and long, and they get the big play to convert. What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about, making the big plays when you need to, and you can't coach that. Look at those stats. That's the definition of a standout year. Hasselbeck throws a bullet here, and it's tipped incomplete. Rodney Harrison couldn't have read that play any better if it was tattooed on the inside of his helmet. That had protected. That time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. The line of scrimmage, the 48. Wilson's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. Second down and 11. Lynch is going to get it again here. It's Mayo who... Hasselbeck fires this one over the middle and they can't connect. Incomplete. Lines up for the punt. Ruin takes the long snap and punts it away. Brown gets it at the... Locked down at the 19. 
Troy Brown, one of those old dogs that can still get it done. 12-year man out of Marshall, smart player. This guy has been in the league. And it'll be Ryan back to punt. They'll take it looking down. Bowler made the save, dropping the ball carrier before he could get to the markers. That's his second tackle so far. Third down, just a single receiver on the field. Dillon chews up four yards, and they convert the third down. Boy, Dillon just slammed through the D on that play for a few extra yards. They help block for the QB. Second down coming up. Scans the field. Walks to go deep. With the contact, the ball comes out. Dillon takes it with the toss and will end up losing a couple. Chad Brown targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Nice job eliminating any forward progress on that play. That will bring up a third and long. Third down, one man back. This pass will fall harmless. There are so many players down the NFL that are good. How about this tight end? He has got so much talent. That time he hauls in the pass, it just makes it look so easy. 